Welcome back everyone to Let's Play Assassin's Creed 2. Wolves in sheep's clothing. clothing. Okay, so I need to protect the Medici family. Oh, I slaughtered that name, but... I think you guys know what I mean. Let's, uh... Can I... Dang it. I was hoping I might be able to recruit these ladies to, uh... Follow me around. Lorenzo, his wife. There's Giuliano, Lorenzo's brother. Where is Francesco? There he is. Time to strike. Crespa, there he goes! Not good. Your day is done, Lorenzo. Your entire family dies by my sword. Fuck! Men! I kill! You cross it on yourself! Die! Just die already! Please! I need help! I miss the uh, combo kills from Brotherhood and Revelations. It's much easier to run through these guys. I didn't realize I just looted his brother. You saved my life. It's nothing. But the man who did this to you has to pay. Ah, not now. I need help. To my home. People I trust. Can you? Ah. Uh-oh. Bad time to take a drink. All right. I'm losing a lot of blood. We'll get you there, don't worry. Hang on, signore. I'm moving as fast as I can. Ah, oh, dang it. I wanted to... Francesco, they passed me! I'll kill him. I'll wipe his Easier to just try and avoid these guards. They'll be a race. I always get lost. Conserve your energy, or I'll be delivering a corpse. You're almost there. Ah, dang it. <laughs> Told you, I always get lost. 
No, that's not it. Oops, sorry. Get out of my way. Lorenzo's been wounded. Aprite la porta. What's the password? Polizia, open the maledetta porta. May the Christ greatest come in quickly. The city is at war. Hurry. Wait. I am in your debt. Tell me, why did you help me? You are not the only one who lost a brother to the Pazzi. My name is Ezio Auditore. Ah. Your Giovanni's son. Your father was a good man. He understood honor, loyalty. The Pazzi thugs are storming the Palazzo della Signoria. We cannot hold them off much longer. No. If they get inside, they'll murder our supporters and put their own devils in power. Then my survival would mean nothing. I have to... Francesco de Pazzi. Help save our city, Auditore. Kill him. Gladly. Alright. I guess I used up all my medicine. Why did I not pull out my sword right away? Come on. Trying to find some more medicine. Apparently I used up all the medicine I had. Oh well. Let's uh, speak to him. I saw Francesco lead a battalion around the back of the Palazzo della Signoria. I fear he may be seeking another way in. Go, before it's too late. Do what you can! I will do my best. <clears throat> Seriously? Oh, there's the... Oh my god. Did I really just fall that far? I don't remember what I have coming up here. Alright, there's the really tall tower. You probably would, that's why you're not going to follow me that- ooh, here we go. Well, those courtesans were a waste. Uh, oh, I remember now. You again? Why aren't you dead? Men, slaughter him! Alright. 
Now, my goal, if I can achieve it, oh my goodness, that was not my goal. Um, I need to try to get up there where he is. And from over here tends to be the easiest way. I do have come on guys lose interest Come on, come on, come on. Go, go, go. Where'd he go? Get the hell up. Don't go sideways. That was terrible, but oh well. Now Firenze will judge you for what you've done. It's over. It's all over. Meglio essere felici in questa vita e aspirare a esserlo nella prossima. Requiesca e pace. I see there's a codex underneath where I'm at, but I think uh, that this sequence is done, we're going to destabilize and then come in at a different point.
When I was six years old, I fell into the Arno. I soon found myself drifting down and into darkness. Certain my life was at an end. Instead, I woke to the sound of my mother weeping. At her side stood a stranger, soaking and smiling at me. My mother explained that he had saved me. And so began a long and prosperous relationship between two families. Yours and mine. I am sorry I could not save your father and brothers. You have nothing to apologize for. I believe Jacobo de Pazzi played a part in their deaths. The attack on you as well. I need to find him. That coward fled before we could arrest him. Have you any leads? No. They've hidden themselves well. They? Jacopo was not the only conspirator to escape. If they work with Jacopo, they were surely involved in the plot against my family as well. Give me their names. Antonio Maffei, Archbishop Francesco Salviati, Stefano da Bagnone, and Bernardo Baroncelli. Bene. I will go and see my uncle. He has men stationed in the countryside. Wait. Before you go, Codex page. I took it from the files of Francesco de Pazzi, seeing as he clearly no longer needs it. I've always had an interest in things of antiquity, as did your father. It is meaningful to me as well. Then consider it a gift. Che il Signore ci protegga. All right. Well, um, I think I'm going to call that it for this part. And I'll jump in back at my uncle's place. I think I'm going to grab some of these codex pages that I see here on the map. But uh, when you see me again, it will be at this next memory. Thank you all for watching. Tune to the next part.